Good morning, church family, and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Pick up a photo album, a memory book, or maybe more relevant today, scroll through the pictures of your, on your phone that you took this year. What I hope you'll find are faces of the ones you love, of places that are special to you, of moments that have great meaning. When we look back on our memories and our photos, we tend to find the things that we're grateful for. Not a lot of pictures of bad things, not a lot of pictures of trouble, but pictures of love and what we're grateful for. Maybe not right now, but six months, a year, two years, you'll look back on those pictures of 2020 and you'll see all that you had to be grateful for. It's interesting, who would have known? Only God, I suppose. But this time last year, we had an intergenerational event where we were saying goodbye to the year and looking forward to the year to come. And I found this quote that I shared with all of you then and I'll, and I'll share it again with you now. And that quote as we closed out 2019 was, look back, look back and be grateful. Look ahead and be hopeful. Look around and be helpful. Look back and be grateful. Look ahead and be hopeful. Look around and be helpful. We couldn't have known how useful this mantra would be for this year. But I do feel certain that it will be helpful again in the year to come. And I think it pairs so well with the testimony we have in our gospel today from Simeon and Anna. It's an intergenerational story here for us once again. We have the child in Jesus. We have the parents in Mary and Joseph, and we have the roles of grandparent, even great-grandparent present in Simeon and Anna. And their testimony was to give all of us this truth that they indeed were very grateful and very hopeful that they would see the Savior and their message and their testimony and proclaiming that they had met Jesus and that He was our salvation was helpful to the people then, just as it is helpful to, for us here today. So in the year to come, as in the year behind us, let us continue to look back, be grateful, to look ahead, filled with the hope of Jesus, and to help one another in sharing that love. Amen.